New developments in the mysterious death of an Athens woman in Habersham County. Video was, has surfaced of Debbie Collier at a Clayton business the day before investigators found her body miles away from the store. Fox 5's Kevin Stewart has the video and he is live from Habersham County's Sheriff's Department with more details. Yeah, Christine, uh, investigators are calling this case complex and certainly they have a lot more to do. But this new revelation video is clearing some things up. This is Debbie Collier walking into a family dollar in Clayton, Georgia on Saturday, September 10th. It's just before 3 p.m., only hours before Collier's husband reported her missing. In this security camera video, you can see her picking up several things, including a rain poncho, a tarp, paper towels, and a torch lighter. The Habersham County Sheriff's Department says this clue is crucial. A spokesman tells Fox 5 News all of those items were found here at the crime scene the next day, next to Collier's nude body with burn marks on it. They didn't know how they got there, now they do. Also, they now know Collier was still alive at three that afternoon. But here's the added twist. In a statement, investigators say over the weekend, Collier's daughter, Amanda Bearden, told them she was at the Clayton Family Dollar that Saturday. A review of security video and interviews so far hasn't backed that claim up. And we have been trying to reach uh, Ms. Bearden all day, but have been unsuccessful. We came here to the Sheriff's Department uh, scheduled to get an interview, uh, but they decided that they're going to hold off until later in the week to do on-camera interviews. And of course, we will be there and have those latest developments. But for now, we are live in Clarksville at the Habersham, uh, Habersham County Sheriff's Department. Kevin Stewart, Fox 5 News. Wow. Uh, wonder if officials are any closer to solving this. Uh, Kevin, keep us posted. Thank you.